Hello, I am Steven the Calculator Guy, and today we're going to talk about Hector Dow. Now, not a sponsor, I'm not endorsing this coin. Uh, however, they are doing something different and interesting, so I do want to talk about that aspect of their protocol as well as the calculator that I made for them. Uh, so, Hector Dow is uh, they may get upset about this, but it is a fork of Ohm. Uh, however, where they are unique is that they offer something called 4.4, which is rather interesting, which we'll talk about in a little bit. Uh, and they are continuously innovating um, and hopefully will release other interesting bonding opportunities in the future. What I don't like immediately is that they talk about paper hands and diamond hands and smart hands uh, because I... It's nonsense, right? I want you to make your profit. Um, so if you buy in, you get 2x, 3x, be paper handed, sell, you know, make money for you and your family. That's always the goal of investing. Uh, so I don't really like this terminology. Um, I do like the UX, definitely. Uh, you know, they have a market cap over 100 million. Um, most forks definitely do not. So I was pretty surprised uh, and impressed by this. At first I dismissed Heck because I thought it would just be another fork that would maybe hit 50,000, maybe hit 70,000, uh, and then, you know, do a U-turn and go back down. Um, it hasn't done that. I think that's in part because of their interesting bonding mechanism. So let's talk about that. Uh, so Heck now has something called 4-4. Now what 4-4 is, is it is a four day bond that you purchase with meme at the moment hopefully they'll have more 404 bonds in the future but what sets this apart aside from just being four days instead of five days is that what you're buying with this meme is staked heck so instead of buying heck at a discount you're actually buying staked heck at a discount uh, so in this particular case you're getting a staked heck at a 0.54 percent discount which means you're buying heck that's already staked for you at a cheaper price than it already is so anytime you see a a positive value for the 4-4 meme means you're doing better than just staking because you're getting it at a discount you're buying all the staked heck at a discounted price uh, it's automatically staked already but then it's getting vested to you over four days so you're still getting all of the rebases which is phenomenal um, but you just got it at a discount the only difference is it's illiquid right so you don't have to wait four days to uh, actualize all of your staked heck but there it is so there are many different strategies you can uh, have that may maximize this maybe every time the meme goes above a certain percent maybe it's one percent or two percent you will unstake your hex sell it and then buy the meme bonds and you know be in a four-day sort of contract uh, or maybe you know this is just how you want a DCA you, every oh so every so often when you see a good discount here you'll buy in but that doesn't mean that this is always the best option so um, before we get into all that, let's talk about how to how to utilize the phantom chain. So this is something that a few people have asked me about, which is if I want to do heck Hector Dow, if I want to do uh, phantom ohm or phantom whatever it is, if I want to do tomb phantom liquidity pair, awesome liquidity pair, tomb is really cool. Uh, if I want to do all these fun things on phantom, how do I do it? Well. It's not super easy. Uh, Phantom is one of one of the more difficult chains to be a part of, in my opinion. But I love the Phantom chain, so I'm glad to help people out. The first thing you need is to set up your Phantom wallet. Now that part is super simple. Uh, just go over to any of the any of the big swaps. Could be Spirit Swap, could be Spooky Swap. It doesn't really matter. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and delete my Phantom wallet just so I can show you how easy it is to set up. Uh, let's see, Phantom Opera. Delete. See what I'm doing? I'm deleting the wallet. It doesn't mean I lose my funds. It just means it's not connected to MetaMask. Okay, so I'm going to click enter the app. Over here, I'm going to look at all this cool stuff SpiritSwap has. Uh, I'm going to click approve. Look, it says, do you want me to add this network? Yeah, of course I do. I want Phantom, Phantom Opera. And then I'll click switch network. So now what you'll notice is that if I go over here, I have the Phantom Opera network. Ta-da! It was that simple to get the Phantom Upper Network on my MetaMask. All right, the next thing you need is Phantom. This is the real pain in the butt uh, because there is no easy way to get Phantom onto your wallet. Uh, unless you have a friend. If you have a friend who has Phantom, ask them to send you some. Most will. Uh, 
The other way is to use a faucet. Now there was a kind of working faucet on Spirit Swap. There's a kind of working faucet on uh, the Hector Dow Discord, and I recommend trying to use that first. So if you go over here, uh, get some Phantom for fees, right? You, I'll have this link in the description, but you go to the Discord. Uh, you have to have had Discord for at least 30 days. Then you go to the faucet, you type exclamation mark. Here, I'll, I'll do it over here, right? exclamation mark or uh, hash bang is that what they call that fountain fountain uh, cool I don't understand fountain no oh, did I spell it wrong uh, faucet of course faucet uh, I have to wait a minute <laughs> so once you do that once you say faucet um, you will get a message I think from, uh, yeah, so the same way this works with the one on Spirit Swap. You'll get a message from a bot uh, that says, like, you have some uh, f phantom to withdraw. Then you will, in a message, in a personal, private, direct message to the bot, uh, type in exclamation mark withdrawal, space, and then paste your wallet. Do not paste your wallet on the Discord page where all the other faucet stuff's happening. Paste it, paste the withdrawal exclamation mark withdraw space address to the private message to the bot uh, sometimes it, if it doesn't work just go into the general chat ask someone for some phantom uh, they'll, they'll help you out most will help you out and if they don't help you out find me on Twitter send me a message uh, I'll give you a little bit of gas money okay you know that that's, that's that's what we do right we want people to use the phantom chain it's an awesome chain I love it uh, a lot of great opportunities on there I am more than happy to help people play around in the phantom chain and really it's like 20 to 60 cents so i don't mind uh but please try the try the faucet first don't directly go to me uh, don't bypass the hard work try the hard work first if that doesn't work if you're still struggling uh if no one's willing to help you i'll, I'll help you i don't mind so anyways once you have some uh some phantom in your wallet then you want to bridge some money over there so i use any swap i think it's the best bridge uh for most things and depending on what chain you have, you'll probably have Ethereum chain if you're watching this video. So maybe you have Ethereum chain, which is, I, I am sorry if you do, right? Because if you have Ethereum chain, you're going to pay some fees. But I, I bridged some money from Ethereum earlier today. It really wasn't that bad. Uh, so <clears throat> you'll choose the Ethereum chain. You'll choose the Phantom chain. I have it swapped because I'm on here. I'll switch it for you. I don't mind. No skin off my back. Let's do Ethereum mainnet. Switch over to Ethereum. Okay, there we go. So Ethereum, you do not want to send to Binance Smart Chain. Ethereum to uh, Phantom. Choose whatever coin it is. Could be USDC, could be USDT. I mean, they give you a wide variety of options that you can send. Uh, I have, oh yeah, I guess I do have some nice. I could send my nice over there and then sell it easier. No, okay, so anyways, this is what you do, right? Uh, you'll, you'll have to approve it first, so it'll be like a 20 to 50 dollar fee just to approve whatever it is and then another 30 to 60 dollar fee to send it so you're looking at almost 80 dollars if you're using this now if you can use the avalanche smart chain it's like 10 cents which is really nice uh, and the avalanche chain hopefully some of you have from utilizing time wonderland um, much much easier to get funds from avax to phantom super easy barely an inconvenience so once you have your money you just gotta Choose what you want to do, right? So that's what we're going to get to now. Look at your options. You can purchase HEC and stake it like you would with Ohm, uh, like you would with Time. Super simple. Where would you buy it? Well, if you just go over to the, if you go over here, right, you can click buy on Spooky Swap, buy on Spirit Swap. It'll pop up a little thingy for you. Uh, it populates already. Maybe I want to use 10 of my Phantom to buy some, some HEC. Um, that's what you do. Super easy, right? Let's say you want to use the meme. Uh, this is what I recommend. Spirit Swap, Spooky Swap, fantastic. I actually have some UST in this wallet. I'm going to convert it. Where's my UST? USD or FUSDT. Right, do I, is it in the wallet already? I bridged it a while ago. I don't know if it made it. Connect wallet, MetaMask. So, 
I recommend using OpenOcean. What OpenOcean does is they scan the chain and all the swaps. You can see the exchange they look for, uh, for the best possible deal. And they'll use that deal to get you the best rate. Um, so let's just say I want to use the meme uh, route. So I'm looking at, <clears throat> look at this, only $2 different. That's really good for this rate. Uh, you try doing that on some other swaps, you're going to see like $30, $40 difference. So I'm totally cool with that. I'm going to swap to meme. I'm going to use this method right now because it's low maintenance and it's still a decent discount. Uh, then if you go back over to Hector Dow, there are also some other options, but let's look at the math. That's what we're here for, right? So Hector Dow calculator with the 4-4. Uh, now, yeah, I want, what did I want over there? Bonding. Yeah, so I'll put bonding and staking calculator over here. Hector Dow calculator over here. And we'll look at it. So the 4-4, right? If you look at the current discount, which, uh, which is 3.8. That's really, really good. Uh, did I already swap? I already swapped. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm doing this now while I have the chance. Well, it's still a good discount. So max, max, max. Can't refresh. Refreshing is the magical, magical operation of DeFi. If something's not working or it's too slow, refresh. Max bond transaction fee. Look, it's 0.2. So uh, 0.2 phantom is probably all the phantom you'll get from a faucet. So keep that in mind. You may you may want to swap some coins for phantom to get you like one full phantom or two full phantom before you start doing transactions, just so you don't run out of gas in the future. Okay, so I went with that. Uh, why did I do that? Because um, it's low maintenance. I don't have to claim to to stake, and I'm getting it. well. Let's look. So with the four four calculator. If I have a 3% discount, then my four day ROI, four day ROI, not five day, four day ROI is going to be 13.22%. Had I simply staked, my four day ROI would be 9.92%. So clearly at this time, the best thing to do was to do a four day uh, meme bond with the 4-4. Four four. Uh, but let's see what other options we would have had. Jump back over to the, uh, the bond discounts and let's look at the best one right now. So, um, pretty good, uh, really good actually. This is five day though. So not four day, this is five day for all of these ones. If you look at the heck die, um, it is currently at 16.44. So we go over to my bonding versus staking calculator, type in the 16.44. Uh, let's just say it costs 60 cents because that's just about what I paid right then to do the claim. Usually it costs like 10 cents, but let's just say 60 cents. Um, five day ROI if you stake before each rebase, which you have to do uh, manually then you will get 22.3% five day ROI. Definitely better than what I just did. However, uh, I'm totally cool with the, the meme because I don't have to create a liquidity pool pair. I can just do this. But let's say you did. Let's say you wanted to do the 20% because that's better, right? Better than the 16 that I'm getting or whatever it was. Um, how do you make the liquidity pool token? Well, it's not that hard. Uh, it's difficult the first time you do it, but once you are get used to making liquidity pool tokens, it's not that bad. Um, so anyways, let's just look at the, right, looking at 9.74% staking versus a 22.3%. Uh, but let me make sure the rebase rate is right. What is the current rebase rate with staking? 0.76. Okay, there's a lot of bonding happening. So 0.76. Six nine one. All right, so bonding actually twelve, but 
bonding with fire 23 percent so clearly bonding is the way to go right um keep that in mind uh now what i do because i actually am bonding some i have my <clears throat> not a sponsor i have my smart speaker which happens to be an alexa uh give me reminders five minutes before i have to claim to stake uh so if we look over here i'm currently doing the usdc because uh, it's single side super low maintenance right you just throw usdc in there and then you click the claim and auto stake five minutes before the rebase um so all you do is click this button before it uh before the next rebase and you'll you will you will then also get the rebase on your awards so that's you know something to consider i know i'm going pretty fast guys i'm sorry let me just show you guys how to make lp tokens uh just so you can utilize these really good ROIs if you want to. Um, so let's open this back up. Uh, click on bond. Let's see, do they have a pop out here? No, they don't. That's too bad. All right. Please approve Hector Die. Let's just see. I don't mind. You'll have to approve it. You have to approve everything in, in DeFi. Um, I'm wondering if there's a place that'll pop out and allow me to just create this. Sometimes there is, sometimes there isn't. Looks like the approval went through, so what do you do? You refresh. The magical tool of DeFi. Okay, so it looks like there's there's nothing that I see that pops out and lets me buy this token easily. Um, hmm, that's too bad. Am I missing something? Uh, redeem. No. Can I click on it? No. Okay. So what you would do then is uh, go to buy on view contract. Can I do this? There we go. All right. Poof. Sorry for anyone who was staring at their screen saying, just click view contract. Uh, I'm sorry. So what you need to do is have 50% heck, 50% die. Um, or whatever it is, right? Whatever the pair is, heck USDC, heck die. You need 50% of each of those assets. Then you'll go, you'll click on the view contract. Sorry for not seeing that. You'll click on the view contract. Uh, you'll click max. Um, there'll be a little max button here. You'll click max. Uh, on whichever one you have slightly more of, sorry, slightly less of. So if you have like one penny less of heck, then you do die. Click max on heck. If you have one penny less of die, click max on die. That's just, you have to do that. So it's an exact 50, 50%. Uh, you'll click approve. I'm sure you'll click supply. What that will do is it will give you an LP token that says you've provided liquidity. You take that LP token and you're giving it to Hector Dow so that they now hold that liquidity and they're now making money off those fees. That's how all of these reserve currencies sort of get cash flow. Uh, it's through these LP tokens that they hold in exchange for giving you discounts. So that's what you'll do. Um, and then you'll go over to whichever one it is. You'll bond it. You'll click max. You'll bond. And then uh, every seven hours and 55 minutes, hopefully you'll click claim and auto stake so you can maximize your uh, five-day ROI, right? Turning that 16% into 23%, um, which is definitely the way to go, in my opinion, with virtually no gas fees. All right, I know that was fast, but it was still almost 20 minutes. So one, I apologize for going so fast, and two, uh, I'm sorry for taking so long. I, I am not monetized on YouTube, there's no ads, so it's not like I'm making money off that. Um, however, if you do want to support me, support this channel, uh, please consider being a patron. You will get access to all of my calculators, every single one, um, which is a pretty good value, I think. You know, well, you know, who am I to shill my own stuff? But the he the Hector Dow calculator is free. I sort of made this for the community because uh, Cryptonaires is really big on this particular coin, and you know, I like the guys over Cryptonaires. I didn't mind doing them a solid. They don't pay me, so not a sponsor. Um, and that, that is by design. I don't, I don't want them to pay me. Uh, good guys though. So anyways, here we go. This is a calculator, just basic calculator that you know. If you want the bonding versus staking calculator, uh, it's on my Patreon, right? All my calculators, paid calculators are on my Patreon for any level of patron. 
Uh, and this can help you with every single um, every single DAO that you're in, because uh, you can change the the gas fees for that particular chain. You can um, change the coin price. You can change the staking. You can you know you can play with this for whatever your particular DAO circumstance is. Uh, you can also buy this from me from literally for literally any price. I mean literally any price. It's from zero, or not zero, from point zero 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 one to infinity. Uh, you can also make a charitable donation to a genuine charity. I like orphanages and women's shelters, and I will give this to you um, for if you prove that you donated to a charity. Uh, that's it. Okay, cool. Um, so, final thoughts. Hector Dow. Uh, I like the... I, I No endorsements. No endorsements. I refuse to endorse a coin, so I... Only doing a how, not doing a should, never doing a should. Um, here's Hector Dow. If you want to invest, now you know how. That's it. Uh, so, as with all these Dow coins, uh, play this dynamically. Don't set it and forget it. Um, utilize some of the best options for purchasing. As we talked about in another video, the people who bond over time will accrue more of the market share and market cap than the people who simply stake. So if you want to be smart, if you want to be safe, if you want to be smafe, you'll utilize these bonding opportunities more often than you utilize just the staking because then you're accruing more of a share of the market cap, which means uh, you will be more profitable long term with any other price action and with the constant minting of the coin. Uh, so that's it. Um, I just looked at, you know, the, yeah, there we go. But, uh, so thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate you guys. Uh, have a great, fantastic, wonderful, blessed day. And hey, it's my birthday tomorrow. So I'm going to probably take tomorrow off because it's also my son's birthday. We're twins, but I'm a little bit older.